Hi, my name is Luca Fanahone. I'm a session musician and producer. I've worked with artists like Stormzy, Emily Sunday, Rita Ora, Craig David, and I'm here to present you this wonderful preamp. It's my signature model called Oxygen One. I chose JK because I've had the possibility to try some of their amps and they literally blew my mind. They sounded so good, so unlike anything else we normally used to. They use a unique technology which made me think I really want to work with these guys and I want to partner up with them to create something very unique. And that is the preamp I'm going to show you now. I've been a Kemper user for six years now. I've used it everywhere in my tours and I love this machine. I love how it sounds. It's amazing. The only thing I've felt the lack of over the years was the true valve response. Obviously, when you plug your guitar through a valve amp, it really gives you that different feeling. It makes you play differently. So I really wanted to retain that quality, still using the Kemper, because I need the versatility. I need all the different possibilities that the Kemper allows me to have on tour. But still, I wanted to have both words at my fingertips. So over the years, I've tried so many different preamps studio preamps, solid state preamps, pedals, so many different things that never gave me what I was looking for. So the JK guys and I decided to partner up and finally create the preamp that I was always dreaming about. And this is it. So hear it for yourself. All right. Just wanted to show you guys what the front panel looks like. We have two inputs here, passive and active, according to the instruments you're using. We have a gain knob which I normally tend to use flat, just so it doesn't break up. But if you want to crank it up, it really gives you a nice harmonic distortion. So if you want to get creative and use it, this is the sound it makes. This is normal. And this is up. Then we have our EQ section, which we can use to really shape the sound the way we want. So, Little changes really go a long way here. Check this. Then we have an output knob, which is basically the level you're going to feed into the camper. A post pre switch. I normally use it post when I use an electric guitar and I switch it to pre when I use an acoustic guitar. And then obviously we have our power switch. On the back panel, we have the output section. We have an XLR out and a jack output. And we have a ground lift switch. My signal chain is normally guitar into the preamp and then out of the preamp into the camper. And I go out with the XLR output straight into the XLR input at the back of the camper. Okay, so this is how the camper sounds without the preamp. I'm gonna be using a clean sound that I normally use. No compression, uh, just a slightly bit of reverb. And this is how it sounds. So check the dynamic response of the sound now. Even when I play very hard, it doesn't really give me that range that I'm normally used to with tube amps. And check if I play rhythm. It's cool, but I'm not really getting what I'm looking for. So here's how the same thing sounds with the preamp. Okay, so this is the same sound, same guitar, but with the preamp. I mean, can you hear the difference? I'm amazed myself. Listen to the definition of each note and also the quality of every note. It sounds like a piano. Listen to this low E. Can you hear all the harmonics in the note? It's amazing.
Listen to the weight every note now has. And go into the rhythm playing. I mean, listen to it. It's just like it has a life of its own now. I mean, listen to the nuances and how soft it is if I play soft. You can even hear the pick better. And then if I play harder... Oof, I'm loving it. So sweet, it just makes me want to play. Ooh. See, this is what I'm talking about.
Thank you.